All right, thanks, Casey. Well, today was Amateur Radio Field Day for members of the Great Falls Amateur Radio Club. Uh, it started out just for me to enjoy, and uh, other people started connecting to it. Sometimes called ham radio, amateur radio is a hobby that not only connects over 8,000 people in the United States, but also plays a crucial role in responding to emergencies and natural disasters. Ham radio operators don't need internet or cell service to do their jobs, making their skills necessary for officials to communicate with each other during major power outages or system failures. Public affairs officer for the Great Falls Amateur Radio Club, Rod Jackson, says the hobby has connected him with people across the world. He's had conversations with operators in places like England no, uh, and uh, Mexico. Jackson says learning ham radio was on his bucket list. And now that he's been doing it for nearly a decade, he's come to appreciate how important it is in helping keep communities safe. Down in uh, places like Florida where they have hurricanes, and central, uh, central United States where I have a lot of tornadoes. Amateur radio has been very uh, beneficial helping uh, local authorities establish, uh, reestablish communications, uh, working to manage shelters, uh, uh, guide emergency responses, particularly when their infrastructure has, has been damaged or eliminated. The Great Falls Amateur Radio Club meets on the first Monday of every month at the Cascade County DES office. All ages are welcome to join. Well, this